Hello, my friends. Uh, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Deanna and uh, welcome back. If you are returning to my channel, once again, um, I wanted to show this process. Um, so this is the planner that I'm going to be moving into for the holiday season. Um, and when I got it, I got it on the pre-loved um, Facebook group. It's like a Moturn buy, sell, trade group. I'll put a link down below. Um, and it is a Moturn Veg Tan personal ring in the Lux, which two buttons. And it is in crimson, which is a really beautiful kind of like cherry red color, a little bit deeper than cherry red. I would say, you know, this is kind of like cherry red. <laughs> this is the little uh, inchworm clip my son made um, for one of his lessons. But anyway, so this is like cherry red and this is crimson. So you can see that red is a little different. Um, so what I wanted to do today is, um, when I got it, it came with some rings, um, and she included the, I think there were, there might've been black rings in here or rose gold. I can't remember. Uh, but I do have a couple extra sets of rings. And so I'm going to switch those out. Um, I've done this in my Gilio. I've done it, I think in my, did I do it in this? No, I didn't do it in my other Moterm. I might have done it in a different size. I think I might have done it in my A6. Um, but this is personal rings and I'll show you why I'm switching the rings. So hopefully you can see the difference in circumference here. Um, this is too small <laughs> for me. So I definitely need it in you know, the bigger rings and I have some larger rings. Typically I will use Krauss rings um, those are my preference. That's what I have in my Gilio. Let me see if I can grab it and show you. Um, bear with me. I should have planned ahead, but if you're not new to my channel, you know that didn't happen. Okay, this is my Gilio. So as you can see, these are my Krauss rings. This is 30 millimeter, um, which are wonderful and I love them and they're fantastic and I will be moving back into this after the holiday but um, for the holiday season I'm definitely going to be uh, in my crimson because I want to get into the holiday spirit and this red is definitely going to get me there so um, first things first I'm going to take out the fly leaf. We don't need that. And I'm going to put those there. And I'm going to need a flat screwdriver, flathead. Um, and then in that little pack here that I've shown you, you can see the little um, screws that I have right here. We'll replace those and we'll hopefully fit right in these little grommets, if that's the word. So step one, open your rings. Now, disclaimer, if you do not like these type of videos, don't watch this video. <laughs> I personally believe that your planner should be functional to you. And if it's not functional because you're too afraid to customize it, um, then, you know, I just kind of think, okay, I heard an ominous little crash sound and one of my kids is playing, so I had to investigate. So hopefully you're able to see this well, but all I'm doing is unscrewing this. Um, anyway, I was saying my personal philosophy is a planner is not useful if it's not being used. So don't be afraid to customize, make changes. Um, Try things out, experiment to see if you can find something to suit your needs. So, um, trying to remember the next thing. Yeah, usually. So sometimes you can, let's do that, put something down kind of as a barrier between you and the rings. 
But essentially what I'm trying to do is <clears throat> peel this little plate off and it'll kind of snap off. And sometimes they're very easy to pull apart and other times not so much. Okay, in this case, it popped right off. Now, if you wanted this to be a traveler's notebook um, or a notebook cover, you could perform some surgery and pop these grommets out and uh, cover, you know, pull out the, there's a back plate in here, you could pull that out or, you know, leave it in if you wanted to reinforce the spine. Um, I've seen people do that before and, you know, um, that's pretty cool. So these are popped out and you can, you know, easily change them. Now there's two different styles with the Kraus rings. They don't um, always do this where you kind of have to pull this back plate away and then pull the rings apart and do that. I've seen um, other videos doing that. But with this, it looks like it's just the, the whole piece kind of comes apart, which is great. That makes my life easier. And so we will line up, pull that on. This is way easier than I was expecting it to be. I was expecting to have to pull them apart like I had to do with my Jillio, but um, with these little screws, it makes life so much simpler. And, you know, I didn't even know you could really do these until, um, or do this until I kind of got online and was seeing other people on YouTube kind of customizing theirs. So um, I thought I would share it just to, just in case, you know, you wanted to see how to do it um, or were afraid to do it or just break down any um, misconception that it's like super hard. You know, if you're trying to turn it into a traveler's notebook, like I was saying, and pull the um, actual, you know, screw or back plate thing out. Yeah, that would be more difficult, but it's possible, it's doable, you know. I've seen people do it. Um, so it's just preference and what works for you. And don't be afraid to try new things and then decide if it's gonna work or not. So we're gonna put this back in here. I tend not to use these. These came with the planner. Um, these kind of gold or rose gold or matte black or things like that. I'm pretty, usually solid gold. And this, this gold is different than the Kraus gold. Um, yeah, solid gold usually is kind of from Krauss is, is my kind of gold if I'm going to do gold, but I'm a silver jewelry person and silver in general. So I tend to go to those. These are just some little dashboards I made. I think they were a Hey Planner Girl. I just printed them off and laminated them. So I'll be using those this winter. We slide that back in and it is already for the holiday. So that's it. If you have questions or uh, thoughts, um, please feel free to share them below. And I am excited to get this set up. I also have this exact same planner in the pocket size. And I was thinking of maybe turning that, last year I used it as like my little uh, recipe book. I was kind of uh, for taking out and about with me with my Christmas list. So I might make that Christmas list and recipes so I don't have to take my big planner with me. Um, so I don't know. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. <laughs> to be determined. Um, but I just wanted to film that little thing. It may seem like a silly pointless video, but I didn't even know you could do it until I saw someone else do it last year. Um, and so I thought it might be helpful and useful. So let me know in the comments if you are going to be switching out your cover for the holiday season. Um, some people do, some people don't, and I'm interested to see if any of you guys are doing that. So um, 
let me know and I will see you next week. Okay. One week. Load this up. All right. Bye.